Man, bro. I need to stop forgetting to put my plate on. I'm not going to lie. I hope this isn't a waste of time because I need to get rid of all of these. I'm not going to lie, y'all. I wish I never bought these wheels just because they're reps. And this whole video is just going to be me ranting about reps. Probably the number one thing I wish I knew before I bought these is how terrible, terrible, how bad the resale value is, bro. You cannot sell these anywhere without people trying to lowball the mess out of you, bro. Like, it's actually frustrating. But I, I was selling these for cheap, and people, like, you you won't, like, you'll be amazed. Y'all will be amazed at how cheap people are when you're already selling, like, a good deal already it's like i get their reps like i i wish i knew before i bought two more pair of reps of how bad the resale value is also how easily like they're so easy to damage bro look how easy that is to get damaged like some of these like my y'all guys i've never hit a curb a day in my life never hit a curb a day in my life right i gotta find the wheel all right so boom check me out never curved my wheels before what is that bro what is that bro it's like damage off a of need for speed bro if you just go fast enough your car is just gonna have random scratches on it like what is this where does where does these rock chips come from and it's like like that's in there there's one right there there's another random one. Oh, that's just dirt never mind but like y'all get the point where did like how do these these garbage doodle wheels just get, i can't even talk bro i'm so mad but anyway don't buy reps moral of the story is don't buy reps they're hard to sell you get a whole lot of unnecessary hate from them i'm talking like comments like these like bro it's like you would think some like somebody with this much energy towards your build would put that type of energy you know into something of their own you like maybe a car or a job you know probably getting some money doing something you like unless people just like hating which is a thing nowadays but like for somebody who's like low budget obviously not rich enough to build cars the way i want to because trust me guys if i had it like that do you think i would literally do you think this car would look like this if i had it like like as i wanted it to if pockets were deep and the bank account just loaded i got three of them joints Y'all think this car would look like this for real? Y'all think I would go voluntarily buy reps when I know there are better wheels out there? These things are heavy. These things are literally like rip off Advan GTs, bro. And who would voluntarily buy this when it's literally this one wheel weighs 10 more pounds than a, the real wheel? It replicates. That's why they're called reps. And I'm just like, bro, nobody voluntarily goes to buy a cheaper lower quality wheel if they don't have to and they just hate like people will real life just like shame you like still like if they could they'll stone you to death over something that has nothing to do with them it's crazy like don't literally if you can if you can stand not to have reps is is you're better off not having them they get damaged easily people will rip you off for them on everywhere you try to sell them and then everywhere else Look at them. I guess they rolling with us. Bam was rolling with us to Lafayette. That's where we're going. Look at them goons. But anyway, I'm going to wrap this rant up. Haters, they're cheap in quality and they break easily. They, they really break easily. Like, you really got to be careful with what reps you get. If you get reps, guys, get it because you like it. Get it because you like it, and that's what you want, literally. All right, y'all, we loaded up. We loaded up. Y'all can't see. Boom. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Reps official. It's reps official around here. We got big bam bruiser in the... Camaro, that V8, that V8, I don't know, I don't know what I'm saying, guys, I'm not gonna lie, um, I was trying to say he beat V8s, 
but I couldn't make it sound cool. So follow him, you know. We about to head out of town. Hopefully see this deal go through and whatnot. And I'ma just bring y'all along. guys so we made it to Lafayette we're out of town and this is one of the other reasons I hate reps because when it comes to selling them nobody's serious about buying them for real we drove all the way out here and this loser is a no-show bro like I'm at the point bro nobody's like I'm not I'm not driving out my way for nobody bro this was this was a reach all together but I'm thinking since like we was talk he was talking a whole lot of good stuff, whole lot of noise, whole lot of hot noise. Talking about we could meet somewhere, XYZ, cash is good, all of this is going on this car, everything's all good with the wheels. I sent them the wheels, I sent everything about the wheels, the information damages and all of that. Everything, all the conditions and all of that. He agreed to it, cool. Meet up, this man is nowhere to be found, bro. And I'm really pressed. I'm not gonna lie. This this the type of junk right here. This is why, honestly, selling with, selling anything in general is a reach. Like, you already got to deal with either sketchy or retarded people. And then, beyond that, the apps that you have to go on to talk to these boneheads, don't they don't even have any brain cells to know what's going on. Like, bro, you give, you give them a time and a place, and they respond to neither but let you cancel everything because they don't respond and then they get hot and then they wonder why you didn't show up or why didn't you communicate but then you communicate and it's the it's literally vice versa like bro i'm not gonna lie bro i'm i'm beyond pressed right now guys beyond pressed this this was a lesson learned i'm not doing this again like i'm not driving nowhere again this dude oh my goodness we really drove all the way out here for nothing and it was a nice nice little ride too these boneheads can't drive out here either like literally i pull up at a gas station this woman is this close to my car like what you trying to hold hands i'm very hot right now guys i'm not gonna lie don't sell wheels on facebook marketplace a whole lot of weirdos are on that app and a whole lot of people who just dare to talk are on that app too bro oh my gosh like, I'm convinced, like, everybody on Facebook Market has a second grade reading level. Like, I, I'm, I'm beyond blown right now. 